guys welcome back to another video so today or should i say tonight because it is nighttime i just got done studying today doing schoolwork for about i don't even know how long but i basically started doing it at like 10 this morning and i've been doing it ever since and it's like almost seven o'clock so time to decompress from all the studying so i figured tonight might as well relax take some time to myself do some self-care so i'm gonna share with you guys what we're gonna be doing tonight i figured i could share this with you guys because maybe you're feeling the same way um i know a lot of my subscribers are around the same age as me it might be in college as well or just in normal school and you're stressed or you're stressed about life in general so take some time for yourself take some you time do what makes Makes you feel good and amen that's it <laughs> i'm gonna start this self-care night off with a nice hot shower and so i'm gonna go hop in the shower and i'm gonna share with you guys my favorite things to use in the shower when i want to you know relax and as well as prep for a fake tan because we are gonna do a self tan as well without further ado let's get into this self-care night I wanted to do a voiceover for this part of the video and share with you guys some of my favorite products. So first, my shampoo. I love this. I always use it. And then I got this scalp massager from Amazon. Highly recommend. It's amazing. Um, and I also really love this deep conditioner from Briogeo as well. It's the Honey Bear Hair Mask. Of course, TikTok made me do it. The ever so popular Tree Hut Body Scrub and the Tree Hut shave oil which is new to me but i'm obsessed my tula facial cleanser which is so gentle and amazing it's really really good along with that i love the tula pumpkin sugar scrub for your face it's really great my all-time favorite body wash ever is the dove deep moisture so those are all my products that i wanted to share with you guys that i love to use in the shower when i want to relax we're back from the shower and we're gonna do my least favorite whoa the hiccup. We're gonna do my least favorite part of taking a shower, and that is this. I literally hate doing my hair. I cannot wait to get these extensions out. I use this leave-in. It's my favorite. Redken One United. I'm gonna run through this quickly because I've told you guys a million times what I do with my hair. Excuse me while I take 15 minutes to brush my hair out. Okay, next, after my hair's all brushed out, I'm gonna put the Olaplex number no. six bond smoother in. It looks like this i love this stuff i'm gonna put a lot of this because my extension needs some tlc and then what's ever left over i put on the top of my hair next and final step to my hair is this very very ratchet bottle excuse it hazel ate it the other day and i'm really just grateful um and blessed truly that she didn't entirely ruin the bottle and i can still use it this is the unite you oil i got this from my hairdresser i don't know if you can buy this anywhere i think you can buy it online hair oil is a must all right now that we are nice and moisturized what am i look at my rope you now that our hair is all done i think i'm gonna add a little face moisturizer just real quick so i'm gonna use three simple products i'm gonna do this i don't even know how to say that but that's what it is <laughs> i don't know how to pronounce that but it's a brightening acid so it's from the ordinary i'm gonna put this on then i'm gonna do the ordinary I can pronounce this one. It's the organic cold pressed Moroccan argan oil. Um, I use this when my skin is insanely dry. Hazel also got this, but um, she didn't destroy it like she did my bottle of hyaluronic acid. Rest in peace to my HA. That girl's gone. I had to toss her in the trash can. So now I'm going to use my favorite moisturizer ever, the Ordinary Natural Moisturizing Plus Hyaluronic Acid Surface Hydration Formula. Long name, but it's beautiful absolutely love it so let's put a little layer of this on i love the ordinary skincare let me know if you guys would like to see like a skincare routine i don't really have a routine that i do like morning and night but like skincare favorites would you guys be interested let me know <laughs> and then of course some um, jack black intense lip therapy lip balm this is the bomb.com literally that was disgusting i can't believe i said that but i love this stuff so okay now that that my hair is done i think the next step is self tanner let's get that supplies together and get started okay guys 
This is a really weird ankle. So in my last video, I shared that I got this new self-tanner from Maui Babe. Now, I've never tried this. Like I said, new. One of my friends told me about it. So I immediately went and looked because I love Maui Babe and all of their like tanning products for the summer. If you're familiar, they went viral on TikTok last year and sold out and you couldn't get them anywhere. But this is brand new, okay? It is the Maui Babe Sunless Tanner One Hour Streak Free Self Tan. There was only one review and then since then when I bought it, which was last week, there's been like four more reviews of people saying it's amazing so I'm excited it is a light to medium tan I normally go for dark tans but I want to give this a shot but if I like the color I'm gonna use this as like an over spray for the summertime but tonight we're gonna test it out I don't know if you have to wash this off or not but I'm definitely gonna sleep in it because that's what I always do that's what I always do and they never catch me and they ain't gonna catch me. okay stop I'm embarrassed. I'm trying to think of a way I can show you guys what this tan looks like. So I think I'm going... The first step in any of my self-tanning, I always put a lotion on, like, the dry parts of my skin. My skin's pretty moisturized because I used, like, that shaving oil, which I showed you guys. Let me get my uh, camera pulled up for my video. Okay, so I'm recording on my phone right now. Okay, so I'm recording on my phone right now. Here's my leg. I don't want you guys to see my foot. So, gross. No feet pic. Yeah, I'm going to show you right now what the tan looks like. So, I'm just going to spray it. Oh my gosh, it kind of sprays crazy. It has such a strong coffee scent. Oh my gosh. So now I'm going to take the mitt and rub it in. I'm so scared of this. This is live action. And then we'll compare both of my legs. It has a very strong coffee scent. Okay, I think that's good for one layer. Let's see. Um, I feel like you can't really tell. This is one I put the self tanner on. This one I didn't. You can kind of see this one's a little bit darker. I think I'm going to go over it up a little bit more. But so far, I like the way it applied. It was really smooth. Okay, so far, it was really smooth application. I kind of liked it. But I'm going to apply the rest and let you guys know. I think it's going to be a really nice little like natural glow. So I'm excited. So right now, I'm just going to put the rest of the tan on and I'll come back. Okay, I'm back in in comfy, cute PJs. These PJs are from Target, if you're wondering. Um, but I finished the tan, and it wasn't bad. It was weird. It was strange. I'm not used to, like, spray bottles like that, so probably shouldn't have done it standing in front of my air vent because all of it was blowing back on me, but, like, I don't know. It was kind of a mess. So it kind of looks like I still look pale, but, like, a little bit of color. It says to give it, like, two hours to develop, so whatever, but I'm sleeping in it, so eight hours it is. It dried so quick, which is amazing. I don't feel like it's like sticky or anything. I'm going to go downstairs to my bathroom, brush my teeth, um, try to clean up the tanner that dropped on my toes <laughs> so they don't look gross, and then come back up here and I'm going to show you guys how I whiten my teeth. All right, guys, I'm back. I brushed my teeth and I got the excess self tanner off my toes. I'm in my nice comfy bed because this is where we're going to hang out while we whiten our teeth. So today I'm going to be using using Nova Shine. So it comes with this mouthpiece that plug into your phone. So no batteries, nothing like that, no extra cords needed, just this. And I have an iPhone, so I plug it in. Oh my god, that literally blinded me. So then you go like this, literally that easy. I'm gonna unplug it real quick because I haven't put the gel in it. So this is the teeth whitening gel that comes with it. It is like such a cute packaging. I don't know if you can really tell but my teeth are like so bad. I'm a big coffee drinker. Yeah I drink a lot of coffee and like dark colored things so I probably am the biggest advocate for teeth whitening. But this is just really simple like put the gel in, put it in your teeth, connect it to your phone, no charger needed so you don't have to be like oh my god it's freaking dead. I can't use it. Use it whenever you want. Bring it wherever you want. You can literally do it in the car on the way somewhere. It's so simple. You could do it in the morning or add it to your night routine. And the gel isn't even gross. Like, I've had gel that I've gotten from my dentist before and I thought it was so nasty. You literally just fill this top and bottom. I'm going to turn my TV on. I would watch Girls Incarcerated, but I already freaking finished it. So, that's a really good show to watch while you're doing this. But I think I'm going to put it on YouTube. Watch some YouTube 15 minutes and then take this out. And I'll come back to you guys you could see what my teeth look like so this is what they look like before <laughs> very discolored but we're working on it <laughs> yeah i'm gonna put this in plug it into my phone and sit here and watch tv It's in the night. I'm 
closing my blinds and I'm about to turn my lights off and go to bed, but this is the after. I don't know. It's hard to tell. I'm sorry. I need to put my retainer back in. I'm going to take pictures and keep like doing my progress, but I feel like my teeth look whiter. It's just me. I don't know, but I'm going to keep using it because I think it is actually helping my teeth considering the amount of coffee I drink and how discolored my teeth get. I guess this is the end of my little de-stressing self-care night. I'm going to continue watching YouTube. I'm going to get in my comfy bed with little Miss Hazel. She's asleep on the floor, but I'm going to put her in my bed and we're going to cuddle and then go to sleep. I hope you guys enjoyed. As always, subscribe down below if you're not subscribed already. And don't forget to turn on your post notifications so that you're notified when I post because I think I'm going to do a new upload schedule. Then you're seeing this video on a Wednesday, so I hope you're excited. Yeah, guys, that's the end of today's video. I will see you guys on Sunday in my next video. Bye, guys. No.